Welcome to the Westview Sailing RYA Day Skipper tutorial videos. I'm Duncan Wells, author of the stress-free series of sailing books, creator of MOB Lifesavers, features writer for yachting magazines and principal of Westview Sailing. I'll be taking you through the exercises. You'll find the tutorials have a logical progression to them and follow the structure of pretty much any day skipper shore-based course. This is certainly the order we run at Westview Sailing. We use the RYA Charts 3 and 4 and the RYA Training Almanac, and if you're already on a course, you should have these, and of course a plotter and a set of dividers. We start with the chart, then rocks, wrecks and obstructions, position, plotting a position, bearings and distance, and then magnetic variation and deviation. By the way, day skippers don't need to allow for deviation in the chart work exercises or in the assessment, but they do need to know what it is and how to allow for it. Then we have fixing a position. Where are we? Then, in the build-up to estimated position and course to steer, we look at tides. There's a lot of very useful general information on this video, such as the explanation of once in a blue moon, and how to tell what the tide is doing by looking at the moon. Then we have the tidal hour and tidal diamonds and the tidal stream atlas and leeway. And now we're ready to tackle estimated position and course to steer. Then we move away from the chart to look at tidal heights and second reports. There are no second report questions in the day skipper assessment. Day skippers just need to have an awareness of the corrections for second reports. Then it's time zones, aids to navigation and anchoring. Even if you're not doing a shore-based course, this anchoring video is worth watching. Anchoring is such a great thing to do, and if you're confident about anchoring, you can enjoy the peace to be had by getting away from it all. We have a tutorial on the running fix, which is a lovely piece of navigation that uses just one charted mark to find your position. Then we have which tide table bite-sized and which tide table the full version. Bite-sized is a quick reminder and the full version is the full picture with all the detail. Both worth a look. They'll keep you on the straight and narrow when it comes to which tide table you're going to use for tidal stream information and which to use for tidal height information. Finally, relating the electronics to the traditional, we have electronic aids to navigation. A couple of videos to take you through the chart plotter, AIS, radar, MARPA, sonar, all the sort of electronics you'll come across when you step on board a boat. So that's it. Have fun, enjoy the tutorials, and good luck in your shore-based assessment or practical exam. And if you're not actually on a course but want to do your RYA day skipper shore-based theory, come and join us online. The Westview Sailing online course is presented just like the tutorial videos. You start when you like, go at your own pace, and there are weekly Zoom meetups to make sure that everyone is on the right track. Well, and for people to chat, frankly. Of course, there's always homework and there are assignments, and I'm there all the time to answer any questions. At the end of it, having completed the two assessment papers successfully, you'll be given your Day Skipper Shore Base Theory Certificate.